Good morning. What if you were given this choice? You can have a chance at a longer life if we take off your arm, or you can have a shorter life with your arm. I had to make that choice because I had breast cancer 20 years ago. I had very strong radiation to the right upper chest. 18 years later, about two years ago, I had extreme arm pain and shoulder pain. Eventually I was diagnosed with a sarcoma, a cancer of my right brachial plexus. So it was not conducive to chemotherapy. So the surgeon gave me a choice. You can have a chance at a longer life if we remove that brachial plexus, uh, which renders the right arm useless. And so we recommend that the right arm be amputated or you can have a couple more years of life. We'll give you very strong pain medication. You can be on the couch and keep that right arm. So I chose life and I'm so grateful that I did. My name is Evelyn McKnight. I'm 65. I live on a farm with my husband in Nebraska. And I want to tell you a little bit more about some adaptations, some ways that I need help. And I believe that you're the people who can help me. So I chose life. And one thing that makes this life full and rich and gives me a quality is connecting with my grandchildren. I have uh, seven grandchildren and all of them live a long ways away from me. So to connect with them, I've, we've started having grandma story time through video chat. Um, let me show you how difficult this is. So they're small children. The oldest one is seven and the youngest one is one. So I have to do this, I have to read to them and keep them engaged, talking about the pictures and the story and then try to turn the page quickly and efficiently so that I keep their attention. And as you can see, that's difficult to do. Well, the doctor said that I couldn't use a prosthesis because I'm missing too many parts. But I'm so curious and so encouraged by the work that you've done that I'm eager to explore the possibilities. So I've engaged a prosthetist who is helping me obtain a vest kind of garment. This will provide more stability and more surface area for a prosthesis to attach to. Please help me. Let's work together so that I can turn the page on a new chapter in my life. Thank you so much for the work that you are doing uh, as a limb difference person. I so appreciate how you have reached out to others that you have the heart and that you have the passion for helping people to really fully realize their potential. Thank you so much. I hope to meet you someday and uh, looking forward to working with you.